Gyani Zail Singh was the seventh president of India, serving from 1982 to 1987. Prior to his presidency, he was a politician with the Indian National Congress Party, and had held several ministerial posts in the Union Cabinet, including that of Home Minister. His presidency was marked by Operation Blue Star, the assassination of Indira Gandhi, and the 1984 anti-Sikh riots. He died of injuries in 1994 after a car accident. Early life, he was born in San Juan, Fariakot district on May 5, 1916 to Kishan Singh. He was a Sikh by religion, was given the title of Gyani, as he was educated and learned about Guru Granth Sahib at Shahid Sikh Missionary College in Amritsar. However, he did not have formal secular education. State politics, in 1947, with the reorganization of India along secular lines, he opposed Harinder Singh, ruler of Fariakot state and was incarcerated and tortured for five years. He was called on to be the revenue minister of the recently formed Patiala and East Punjab States Union, under Chief Minister G. N. Singh Rawala in 1949 and later became Minister of Agriculture in 1951. From 1956 to 1962, he was a member of the Raya Sabha. Chief Minister of Punjab, Zail Singh was elected as a Congress Chief Minister of Punjab in 1972. He arranged massive religious gatherings, started public functions with a traditional Sikh prayer, inaugurated a highway named after Guru Gubind Singh, and named a township after the Guru's son. He created a lifelong pension scheme for the freedom fighters of the state. He repatriated the remains of Adam Singh from London, armaments and articles belonging to Guru Gubind Singh. Central Government, in 1980, Zail Singh was elected to the 7th Lok Sabha, and appointed to join Indira Gandhi's cabinet as Minister of Home Affairs. He patronized Bindran Whale and twice helped stall action against him on murder charges by disposing in the parliament about his non-involvement. President of India, in 1982 he was unanimously nominated to serve as the president. Nonetheless, some in the media felt that the president had been chosen for being an Indira loyalist rather than an eminent person. A year ago if my leader had said I should pick up a broom and be a sweeper, I would have done that. She chose me to be president, a Euro Singh was quoted to have said after his election. He took the oath of office on July 25, 1982. He served beside Gandhi, and protocol dictated that he should be briefed every week by her on the affairs of the state. The day before Operation Blue Star, he met with Gandhi for more than an hour, but she omitted even sharing a word about her plan. Following the operation he was pressured to resign from his post by Sikhs. He decided against resignation fearing to aggravate the situation on advice from Logi Pajan. He was subsequently called before the Akal Taklat to apologize and explain his inaction at the desecration of the Hariman Der Sahib and killing of innocent Sikhs. Indira Gandhi was assassinated in 1984, and he appointed Rajiv Gandhi as Prime Minister. Latter term, his remaining term was full of controversies on account of his soured relations with Prime Minister Rajiv Gandhi. During this time, he ensured that the Prime Minister adhered to protocols and forced him to remove K.K. Turi, a Congress MP who alleged on the floor of the Lok Sabha that the President had sheltered terrorists in the Rashtrapati Bhawan. Singh used a pocket veto to refuse a cent to the Indian Post Office Bill in 1986 to show his opposition to the bill. The bill was later withdrawn by the VP Singh government in 1990. Injury and Death On November 29, 1994, Zail Singh was involved in a serious vehicle accident near Karatpur Sahib and Ropa district on his way to the Anandpur Sahib. He later died at the Postgraduate Institute. Chandigarh on December 25, 1994 and was cremated at the Rajat Memorial near Old Delhi. See also, Jani Zail Singh College of Engineering and Technology, References.